Rescued, relieved, and likely regretting a hasty decision. Tonight's storms turning dangerous fast. One man near Anthem getting stuck in his truck. The cops say he ignored the barriers, and John Erickson is joining us live with more on this story. John, how does the driver feel about being ticketed? And the stupid motorist law coming into play here tonight. He tried to make it through, says he'd been able to all day. This time he didn't. Had to be rescued, and now he is officially one of those stupid motorists. And here's helicopter video of that rescue. Firefighters with ropes, helmets, and life jackets got Keith Villa to safety. Just bad judgment. He says he just wanted to go home when that clouded his judgment. Left him stuck on a back road near 9th Avenue and New River Road. Was in an F-150 in a spot better suited tonight for a fishing boat. So, you know, you're getting one of the tickets. Uh, does it make you a stupid motorist? Sure. I'm a... Uh... I'm man enough to say when I make a mistake. You know, uh, I give you, I give you credit for that. Yeah. yeah. I give you, credit for you know, that. when you're wrong, you're wrong. After the firefighters got him back to what's now more of a riverbank than a roadside, I shook every one of their hands and thanked them, man. Kendra Robinson watched the rescue. Says living here on the mountainside makes life different. It's crazy how bad the washes will run, especially after it rains for days. You know, don't go through it. Don't even try. You're either going to hurt yourself or someone else. Keith was a good sport tonight. We peppered him with one more. Well, you see all the stories. We always say, turn around, don't I drown. I know, I know, I know. And if I hadn't been driving it all day long, I, I probably wouldn't have tried it. Remember when a driver goes around barricades like those that were set up here tonight and then gets stuck, has to be rescued? That is when a driver can get one of those so-called stupid motorist tickets, guys.